Hi everybody, I'm Jen with OpenSource.com and I have a brand new top five articles of the week for you today, January 6th, 2017. This is the first top five of 2017. I'm happy to be back with everyone. I took a couple of top fives off in December to take a break, refresh, relax. I did that and I'm happy to be back. Um, this is, if you're new to the top five, this is something that we do every Friday to bring you the best articles from the past week that our readers loved and really enjoyed. So it's a nice little digest of what we've been working on. Um, this top five is a culmination of the past three weeks since um, I took some time off. So just to let you know that this top five comes from the past three weeks instead of the past week. Going forward, we'll do the um, past week as usual. So let's hop into it. At number five, we have top open source creative tools in 2016. So Maureen Duffy is a principal interaction designer at Red Hat, and she tells us about her favorite open source tools to manipulate images, edit audio, and animate stories. At number four, we have top open source projects of 2016. This is our annual list of the year's top open source projects, where we look back at popular projects that our writers covered in 2016, plus some favorites from our community moderators. At number three, we have four hot skills for Linux pros in 2017. Sean Powers of CBT Nuggets tells us that the definition of a Linux expert is constantly changing. So in this article, he shares what he thinks are the four vital skills for a Linux Pro today. At number two, we have hot programming trends in 2016. Get an overview in this article of the year's hottest languages for AI projects and containers, new languages, and new programming trends. And finally, at number one this week, how Linux Got to be Linux, Test Driving 1993 to th through 2003 distros. Seth Kenlon revisits the early release of seven Linux distros to get a picture of what progress Linux has made over the years. And because we covered so much, we covered three weeks, we have an honorable mention. We have 50 ways to avoid getting hacked in 2017. Dan Walsh works on SE Linux at Red Hat. In this article, he shares 50 ways that sysadmins and regular old people can avoid getting hacked. That's it for the top five this week. Glad to be back. Hope you're having a great new year. and I'll see you next time.